Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and today we have for you a 1988 Rolls-Royce Silver Spur. The Silver Spur is basically a long wheelbase Silver Spirit. And it's black with black leather interior and this car is in amazing condition. It drives beautifully. I've driven it, I drove it yesterday. Air conditioning's cold. It really is a stunning car. It's even got spare keys, all the original books from when it was new. It is an import from the UK, but it's in particularly good condition. It's done 33,000 miles. All the timber work is excellent. The dash doesn't have any cracks in it or anything like that. The leather seats, you know, could do with some conditioner, but they're certainly not ripped or anything like that. It's just coming to us and just literally giving it a, a wash with soap and water. I'll start it up. It starts and runs absolutely beautifully. So it's running now. Turn the lights on, we might be able to see more of the dash. It's absolutely beautiful. It's got the nice piano trim, wood trim. You probably can't even tell the car's running, but um, it certainly is, and it's very quiet and smooth. I'll turn it off now. All the power windows work and the central locking. You can see it's a long wheelbase as soon as you open the door. You've got all that room. And it's very nice having the contrast red carpets as well. These late 80s, early 90s Rolls Royces and Bentleys for that matter were absolutely beautiful. And they continued right up until about 1996. Let's turn the lights off. It's got the very nice leather steering wheel. I love driving these old Rolls Royces with a nice thin steering wheel. You really know you're driving a Rolls Royce. The Spur also came with these very nice Rolls Royce hubcats which went up to about I think 1992 or 1993. The tyres are in as new condition. If you wanted to put some white wall, white walls on it you certainly could. But look at the paintwork, it's like glass. Someone's really looked after this car. The boot carpet's excellent. It's got a picnic table in here. The silver spirits are quite, uh, are actually quite common, but there's very few silver spurs. A lot of spirits in Australian examples we've seen have done one, two, three, even 400,000 kilometres in some cases if they've been you know, used for a wedding car business or something like that for a number of years. One of the things I loved about these in the 80s was the beautiful big seats and the headrests. They really were such a leap ahead from the Shadow 2. We've got the books in the glove box here. It's full. It's got the beautiful original Rolls-Royce books, service books, etc. And even to get a car of this age with some spare keys we thought was great. Yeah, and there's some service books there as well. It's got all the original VIN numbers and things. As you can see, Bar Jack Barkley Limited in London on the door trim there, who delivered it. Looking around the car, I can't see any signs of rust whatsoever. I'd suggest this is a car which has been garaged. It's in absolutely beautiful condition. See the 
with a nice gloss on the bonnet there. And, it, and we haven't buffed it or polished it. We've literally just washed it. So it was in very good condition when it came to us, which is a good thing. Looking down the sides, it's very, very straight. I can't see any dents, scratches or scrapes whatsoever. For a car this size to get around for so long and not have any, even some minor scratches or scrapes or anything is remarkable. Back then they didn't have parking sensors and reverse cameras. But it's an absolutely beautiful car. And to be able to own a Rolls Royce in this condition for under $30,000 is incredible. And the good thing about these older cars, you can drive it for a number of years. You can spend a bit of, bit of money along the way, obviously, but you're always going to sell it for close to what you bought it for. In some cases, more. In some cases, slightly less. So there's some of the numbers there. VIN number, weight, it's nearly three tonnes, this car. But looking in all the common places where there could be rust, is that we can't see any whatsoever. Someone's really loved this car, which is very important. It's just come into us, obviously. We'll, we'll give it, we'll get it out to a, a mechanic and we'll give it a service and just give it another basic check over to make sure everything's okay. After driving it, the suspension was excellent. The gearbox was nice and smooth. The air conditioning was cold. It started first go and drove absolutely beautifully. I put some premium fuel in it. In terms of driving, it drives absolutely perfectly, but just to be sure, we will get it to, our, to a mechanic as well. Well, thanks so much for watching our video today. We are the Old Timer Centre. Our warehouse is located in Marrickville, in Sydney, and we're about 20 minutes from the airport. Thanks so much for watching.